All right, guys, it is Wednesday the 7th, and it is 4.45 in the morning, and we're at the gym. So we're about to go in and do some chest and some early morning cardio. Um, so something kind of funny, I guess you could say. Yesterday, I went for uh, a physical to renew some, um, you know, licenses and stuff. And fun fact about me, I have the worst case of white coat syndrome in the world. So when I go into a doctor's office, my blood pressure shoots through the roof. And literally, they would not sign off on my paperwork because my blood pressure was so high. So when you check my blood pressure literally 15 times in a row, obviously, it's going to get worse. So they are making me take a log. Every so often, I have to check my blood pressure, write it down. Literally, when I get home and take it, it's like 125 over something. This morning, it was 112 over something, compared to the 155 to 165 that it was at the doctor's office. So, we're here at the gym at 4.30, gonna get some cardio and chest done, and I'll talk to you guys in just a bit. Yes, I'm still watching Forensic Files. All right, guys, it is Sunday, the 11th of February. We are about halfway through the two weeks uh, off AFM from wrestling. Um, I'm excited for this vlog, though. Uh, you're going to get to see a lot of footage from one of the last weeks, probably even the last week of work we're doing on the new place. So really exciting things happening. And um, if you haven't already, I, at the time of this, I just posted a uh, blog number seven, I believe, about respect. I'll put the link to that on this video. I feel like to me, it's probably the best one I've done yet, just because it was a good time to write that because last week, a lot of guys that I know and a lot of guys that I truly do respect we're at the Performance Center for a WWE tryout. So go check that out. Uh, it features, you know, some guys I consider friends, guys that I've shared the ring with over the last eight years. Uh, I'll put their Twitter handles on here. Go follow Aaron Mockbits, Jackson Stone, uh, Austin White, also known as Austin Theory, uh, Ryan Greenis, also Moonshine Mantel, or now Maverick in the NWL. And uh, Evan Cloyd, also known as Jarek120, who I shared a ring with at uh, Full Impact Pro this last year. So I could not be happier for those four guys and for, you know, like the 30 plus others that were there at the, uh, at the Performance Center. So, you know, it's really good to see uh, people excel. And I never want to be spiteful because I'm literally now working harder than I ever have to further my brand. So, yeah, go check that out. And uh, now what I'm going to show you is some footage over the last week of all the work we've been doing at the new place and some of the finishing touches we've been putting on there. You don't like it? I don't like him. Oh, you don't like him? <laughs> sweater this is um it may go on the store page soon i don't know yet but as you can see we like i said we've already been measuring stuff out uh obviously the bed will go here but we have already started moving a few small things into the new place so something really cool is that check out 
our countertops. Man, they look good. They look really good. I'm really excited about it. Okay, so obviously this is not gonna stay like this, uh, but half of the kitchen countertops are in. The sink is in. Uh, right here will be our dishwasher. Microwave fit perfectly. We were so afraid that this microwave would not fit, so I think we kind of lucked out with how well it fit in there. Yeah. Hey. Yes. So, uh, you want me to go ahead and plug in that fridge in the uh, living room? Yeah, yeah. Okay, how long do you want me to leave it plugged in? I think we'll leave it running for that. Okay, just leave it running? All right, well, I'll go ahead and plug it in. Okay, bye. All right, bye. That was, uh, obviously, that was the man of the hour. That was Papa, the guy that pretty much runs this operation. He's pretty much who I work for. Um, and everything you see, like, I, the whole family had a hand in this, but he is the man of the operation. So, so but I'm going to see if I can get him in the next vlog at least and shout him out because he does... Phenomenal work, and I may be slightly biased, but I wouldn't hire anyone else except for him to do any of my work ever again, so. All right, and to update everybody on the status of the uh, training facility, it is still going good. Um, stuff is being kind of cleaned out. We still have the uh, dishwasher in here being moved in, but as you can see, the washer and dryer has been installed. Um, we have an extra storage area here. Fun fact about this uh, upper right here. So I get here the other day to help install it and I haven't told him yet, but it's obtuse. One side is slightly longer than the other. Okay, what's that side? 18, 18 inches and this side? 19. 19. <laughs> All right. <laughs> it's slightly off, but whatever. Check this out. This is really cool, though. We have like the most modern washer and dryer in mankind. And apparently, I didn't, I wasn't there whenever this was bought, but apparently, this was a steal. Yeah. Hey, I wanted to let you know something. So that uh, the upper that we put in above the washer and dryer, yeah, we've got one side is an inch taller than the other one. Sure no, one side I think one side's nineteen and one side's eighteen. Really? Yeah. Did you it? Yeah, we measured it. It's exactly I an inch. The wrong yeah, but <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> I thought it was funny, so I thought I'd let you know. Yeah. Okay. But no, I got the fridge plugged in and it's running. Okay. Alrighty. Bye. All right. Bye. Bye. So yeah, um, anytime something goes wrong, literally, he never... He, he sees the bad in nothing. He finds it amusing and then just fixes it. That's how he always... I think that's where I got it from. Like, like I said in my last blog, I never try and see the negative in anything like I used to. I was really bad about that. But now, you know, it's it kind of makes it more more rewarding when things are done correctly. Right. All right, so big shout out to uh, Kiyoki and Tanya Wilcox out of Hawaii for the first order from the website. We got two shirts going out to Hawaii, that's crazy. And uh, sorry it took so long to get these out to you guys, uh, the first order while we were away. Uh, it's been a crazy few weeks, but these are gonna be sent off very soon. And guys, I'll put the link to the store page here. And again, thank you to Kiyoki and Tanya Wilcox. I greatly appreciate the first order on the website from you guys. All right, guys, so yeah, a lot of really cool stuff has been going on. Um, today's actually Tuesday. Uh, this week has been absolutely crazy from shipping off uh, my first order to Hawaii to uh, 
you know, finishing up the new place, you'll, you see like all these boxes just kind of like strung around. Uh, th this place was littered with nothing but cardboard boxes um, and just getting everything moved. Also got a new shipment in from Reps Over Rest, uh, the brand that I am a brand ambassador for. I got this awesome beanie in and a new lifting hoodie from them. Uh, so again, go check them out. I will put my code on the screen. Uh, check out, this is one of their ultimate lifting hoodies like I had on before. I was really excited to also introduce you guys to uh, Taylor's parents in this vlog, but I won't be able to do that. Uh, there were some plans that had to get canceled and uh, it's it just, it killed me because of the situation. Um, I know that a lot of people have followed me for a long time and if any of you that follow this vlog have known me since I started wrestling, you know that there's a certain family that has supported me for a long time, uh, the DePriest family. Um, the daughter Kaylee, she was a very close friend of mine in uh, school, all throughout elementary through high school, everything. Um, she has throughout her entire life battled many different illnesses including kidney failures as far as to be put on dialysis almost every day just horrible situations like i i couldn't list the amount of ailments and trials she has gone through and uh unfortunately uh monday uh the 12th i believe she lost her battle with her illnesses and um you know, it's it's a rough deal. Um, it seems like this year I've lost a few people that I knew, but this one was a pretty heavy blow because I knew her very well. So guys, if you will, uh, send your thoughts, your prayers, just all of your positive energy to uh, the DePriest family as I go through this time. Uh, we're gonna be going to the visitation Friday uh, and the funeral Saturday. And uh, that was actually whenever we were planning on meeting up with Taylor's parents was this weekend. But we're working on getting that changed as well. But on a more positive note, guys, uh, again, we're about to move in. As you can see, this place is pretty much getting cleaned out now. And by the way, mind my horrible torn up shirt. I have not been, I've been nonstop since work. So. But anyway, guys, uh, let's try and get this video to 10. Let's try for 15 likes this time. Let's try for 15 likes this time. If you aren't viewing this video on the website, go to it here, www.barrettbrownpro.com. I'll put all of my social media in the video description and it will be plastered all over the website as well. Uh, like this, share this. Let's get the subscriber count up. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, I will constantly be updating this channel and the website for as long as I can. So uh, thank you guys for being here with me. And again, send all of your thoughts, prayers, and positive energy to the DePriest family. Uh, and I will see you guys actually in the new place.